Hey, thank you for taking your precious time to watch my YouTube videos. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and also turn on the notification bell so that you can never miss any of my future uploads. It's Namlok here guys and welcome back to yet another video. Obviously, as you can see, I'm outside and missed shooting in this place. It's been a long while. And uh, yeah, this is a very peaceful environment to shoot in. But uh, obviously you're not here to listen to me talking about the environment. You're here to listen to me talk about uh, while you're still alive. So while you're still alive. So necessarily, what necessarily do I mean or what am I about to talk about today? So forgive me for not looking in the camera. It's just that we have a bloody beautiful view. Keep on looking away. But uh, while we are alive. So I was thinking, you know, we always have these fears of uh, not doing stuff we want or just saying, you know, I'm going to pause for, for the right time. I'm going to wait for the right time, which is necessarily... Sometimes it's a good thing to wait for the right thing. Sometimes it's a bad thing to wait for the right thing. But if you ask me, I usually just say, or what I was thinking about is, I think you should just do what you want to do before you die. Because the sad reality is that no matter how much you try to preserve your own life, one day you're still going to die. Regardless of whether you're going to die young, regardless of whether you're going to die, I don't know, um old or maybe i don't know there's just many ways of dying and for me i was thinking like if i wait for the right time what if tomorrow i wake up and find that that i'm no longer alive and uh i mean who am i going to blame for not doing what i wanted to do so normally the or what exactly is my point in this video today my point is don't sit there in regret don't sit there i don't know just waiting for the perfect opportunity to come so that you can do whatever you want to do listen man things are not going to like turn out the way maybe you want you know there is mishaps here and there but that should never discourage you from doing whatever you want to do like just do it remembering that one day you're going to die that that's the sad reality that 200 years from now you're not going to be on this earth so what really counts is now that you are alive the present time or maybe the time that you're watching this video okay because uh, yeah i think you know people like to assume that life is long i uh, the minute maybe especially when the minute you you finish school is when you realize that time really flies so quickly like you just you just uh it's just the other day i started uh, this youtube channel that's 2017 and you see already we are in 2019 so you see time really does fly quickly and it's it's not that time is moving quickly it's just that the minute you're out of school there's a lot of activities such that you don't keep track of time like days just seem to go without you noticing so my point is just make sure that your time is not passing by and you're there just seated waiting for the perfect opportunity to be whoever you want to be Maybe you want to be a vlogger, maybe you want to be... I don't know, it doesn't matter what you like. It doesn't matter how weird uh, it is. Obviously, if you, you're planning to be something bad, that's not something I would encourage you to be. So I'm not saying that you should take the opportunity to be a psychopath. If maybe that is what you want to be or maybe that is what you love. Obviously, if it's the correct thing or it doesn't inflict pain on other people or maybe it's to you you feel it's correct in your head or oh, it's just something that you have a burning desire to do uh, just take the time and do it okay it doesn't matter how daunting it is because you know at first some things you may want to do may seem so challenging and then like you know i'm speaking from experience here yeah, there's some things like you always want to do and then you go to do them and you realize that it's not easy as you think and you see the 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 bad part or let me just say especially when you you're starting on something maybe you had really or something you are passionate about the bad thing that i noticed is if you constantly do whatever you're doing and then you go you're going ahead to look at the results 
that is a very bad approach to look at things because especially like let me speak in terms of youtube if let's say if you're doing youtube for the sake of earning money that, that is why you even hear most youtubers say that you should just do it as a passion and then the money will come later on because if you keep track the first few years everything is just going to be shit man like you're not going to be getting the views and personally i can attest to this if you can check like the earliest or my earlier videos there's a bloody car moving just wait for it to pass so as I was saying, like my earliest videos, normally some of them used to get six views. And you see now I've gotten to a point where it's like a guarantee. I always get at least 20 views. You know 20 views may seem like a lot, but you see that's growth. For me I can see that there's really a difference since I started and where I am currently. Okay. So uh, while you're still alive, just do whatever you want to do. It doesn't matter like you know there's that fear there's a fear that everyone has where you just feel as if there is there's something holding you back maybe you're afraid of how people will think of you maybe you're you're not confident or maybe there's just there's just fear and it's perfectly normal it's just being human you know some of us are shy some of us are this and that okay but if you look at it this way like what's the bad thing that can happen if i do it and in most cases you realize that the consequences that your brain is telling you that uh, don't do it because of this you'll realize that it's just small things that you're going to overcome uh over time like let's say maybe you want to be a youtube vlogger you see maybe there's that fear of people looking at you weirdly but eventually if you keep on doing it it's just going to become normal to you at one point okay so get past that fear and stop thinking that oh what if I do this? It doesn't happen like this. Okay, listen, you're going to start businesses. You're going to start YouTube channels. They're all going to fail. It's going to get to a point where everything just looks like a total mess. School is fucked. Like, everything just looks so bad. But what I usually encourage uh, someone is just continue doing it. it, it regardless, of, regardless of whether you're seeing progress or not. Just do it. And you see the mistake of a lot of... I think this is a, a mistake that I see people being told. Because I think it's a lie. Growth is never something linear that at it's a straight curve just going. Growth is something very irregular. Like if there's a time you're going to grow and there's a time you're going to stagnate for a very long time. And then again you're going to grow. Like it's just like that. It's never like a constant growth. Because I think the mentality uh, of people is that when you're starting out you're going to grow if you keep on doing it. Listen, there's a point you're going to get the motivation is not going to be there. Okay? And it's up for you to remind yourself that hey while you're still alive let me just do this let me just do whatever i'm good at doing because there is no other time or there's no other life i'm going to do whatever i need to do in my life so if you feel that you want to be a filmmaker if you feel that you want to be a doctor all of these things never let someone tell you that you can't do all of this okay obviously structure your time in a way that it prioritizes um in a way that the the most important things that help you to earn a living are what are at the forefront and then all of these things can remain as hobbies okay structure your time remember you're going to get old one day and you don't want to be an old man filled with regret i think that's a quote from i think that's a quote like it's not even a quote it's just i remembered it in a move yeah inception uh, where if you like uh, if you watch that movie there's a point where if you get lost in the dream for too long you're going to you're going to dream until you become an old man filled with regret so you don't want to be an old person filled with regret because you see like for me in my case there was a point there was a time oh let's just say i don't know if i don't know when i think it was 2015 there was a time i lost my high school friend and you see i remember sitting down with him and telling him maybe there's a time where Arsenal, if, if, uh, I think there was a time I was telling him that Arsenal maybe one day will come to beat Manchester United. And you see, that time for him never came to pass because he left us uh, very soon enough. And I think I thought of that just recently and I thought, I think you should just like do whatever you want to do. Because you know you don't know about tomorrow. You're not sure that you're going to wake up. You're not sure that you're, not, you're going to uh, maybe board a bus or a matatu and get hit or maybe die in a road accident. So while you're still alive, hey, do all of these things you want to do. Do everything that you feel that your heart is telling you. Just do it. Just, um, 
I mean, you do, do those things that your heart is telling you just to do, okay? Because uh, at the end of the day, if you look at the fears that you have, uh, really they don't make sense. It's just, I think it's just your brain trying to convince you to. Because uh, you see, your brain is designed in a way that it needs to protect you. So if your brain feels as if it's being threatened, it's just normal for your brain to uh, start conjuring up. Um, a lot of fear and I think uh, a good YouTube channel I can recommend for most people in, uh, in dealing with some life situation is there's a YouTube channel I think maybe I'm going to post a video on the screen right now it's called the school of life there's a lot of educative videos they post there and maybe the one recently that I watched is that one for fear uh, and where they explained that if maybe you had a traumatic event in the past or when you were a child or it doesn't even necessarily have to have uh, uh, hard to had happen when you're a child but if you've had a traumatic event it doesn't mean that you met with a bear it can also be you started a business and it failed and you see that thing etches in your brain so much to a point that you're even afraid to go ahead and do the same thing again so don't let that thing suppress you in the inside so while you're still alive, remember that you only have this one life to live. I'm sure I've said that in a lot of videos and I don't want to extend this video because I'm sure it's long. I've been blabbing the same thing all over and over again. But while you're still alive, you just do you do whatever you want to do. You know, life is not going to be easy as maybe some people may want you to think. And always remember that the growth pattern of everyone is different. Okay just because your friend is out there making it making a lot of money doesn't mean that you're going to go out there and start making money like them everyone has a different journey every like every path is different okay in the long run if you're doing what you want to do it's uh, you just need to convince yourself you're doing the right thing and continue doing it and in the long run it's going to pay some it's going to pay you like it's going to you're going to bear the fruits of your hard work so you just continue doing you okay don't look at the i don't know the results because don't uh, that is something we call instant gratification don't look at the instant gratification just continue doing it because you need to do it because it's the only thing that it's the one it's one of the few things or it's the things that your heart wants you to do and if you feel that if it's your heart wants uh wants whatever you want to do uh you just need to do it so other than that, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's been a long one. I just felt like talking today. I felt like uh, taking a walk in the nature out here. I know it's a gorgeous place. So if you want me to make more videos in this area, because I remember there was a the last one I made in this area, I uh, got some positive feedback. I think it was about cheating or something like that. But uh, if you enjoy this environment, you can always comment down in the comment section below. Uh, you can always catch up by the way with our live show. There's a live show we usually have every Tuesday called the 254 Millennium Talk from 6 to 7 p.m. Sometimes it can be 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. depending on the on the maybe internet and uh, the, the guys hosting the show. So other than that, uh, you can always join our Discord if you want to be a part of that live show. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Oh, yeah. So you gotta do for me